This is my game room and I'm gonna have my friends customize it. We've had this room for a while and as you guys can tell, the walls are pretty dull and green. Jake, Ben, David, and Mackenzie have said for a while how cool some paintings would look over here. I'm gonna be out for a couple weeks so I told them they could do whatever they wanted with it. I'm pretty excited to see what they paint on the walls. And so, with my permission to paint the walls, Jake, Ben, Mackenzie, and David got straight to work on day one. Alright, I see Dr. Sean McGay! And then we're in the bunker room. Yeah! <laughs> what the? What the? I went to go. What? <laughs> oh yeah, and I left Jake in charge. And this is my first time watching their footage, so hopefully he was a good leader. <laughs> Seemed like they started first by putting a base coat of paint over the full green color. We're painting the wall black because, as you guys can see, this green has just got to go. It's not going to work with the mural that we're painting. We want a nice black background to make everything that we're going to paint on top really pop out. And although putting down a simple layer of paint should be easy, we all know nothing ever goes smoothly with this team. Hurry! Oh, God! Guys! Look! We just started! I know, it's been 30 seconds. Leave it to us to get paint on the floor even when we have the entire floor plastic wrapped. How would Zach ever trust us alone in his house? But even after this little hiccup, the artists rallied together and successfully painted the room black. Good job, guys. Finally dry, so now we can go in and start painting the mural. The artists decided to play to their strengths and let Ben sketch the mural since sketching is one of his strong suits. And as Ben begins to sketch out the poker chips, chess pieces, playing cards, David is actually getting a projector set up and he's going to be making Zach and Michelle on little playing cards. Oh, and bacon. And if you guys were wondering where Mackenzie is, she is actually washing the black rollers right here. Someone's gotta do it. After sketching the entire mural, my friends started to block in each component white so that the color they put on it really pops. We need white so that the other colors can go on top. And I think I should help too. Anybody got me a paintbrush? You'll have to get that yourself. All right, I'll be back in 20. What? Although they've painted a ton of murals, they've never really painted one without me, and Ben started to really notice my absence. This actually feels so weird not having Zach here. I can't believe we're actually working. And like I said, since I'm not around, Jake's in charge of the team. But it may have started to get to his head a bit. Who's the boss? Hey, Ken, want me to fill this one? Sure. Good job. Thanks. Jake, can you put another layer on this? Ben! Painted good. Yes, sir. We need this crispy. Usually when I'm on set, we do a lot of fun challenges. And even when I'm not there, it seems like the artist wanted to keep the tradition going. Give us a challenge and give us money. Oh man, please, Jake. Yeah. Kenzie! I have a challenge. Okay. Can we hear really loud. Can I use the bathroom? Yeah. Unless you want to miss out on $5,000. Sadly for the artist though, it looks like Jake was just scheming to get more work done. First one to finish painting all of these things white hey, wins. Jake, I hope you Go! win. And Jake looked like he was having way too much fun with his little joke. First one to do it wins! I don't think we've ever done an endurance Time challenge. Time is running like out. The artists have to pick up the pace. Jake, you're in this too. Oh! Dude, stop doing that! When you're working fast, things are bound to happen. And by things, I mean spilling paint on the floor. Zach, if you're watching this, Jake is the one that made a mess of your house. Kent, work faster! Get out of my ear! Unfortunately, the artists were working so fast, they ended up running out of white paint. So they had to go get more. Can I have some more white paint, please? I've been painting with no paint. And when he needs it most, Ben just ran out of white paint. Ooh. We're gonna need more white paint. We're literally out of white paint after this. Get it, Bean. After obtaining more white paint, the artist quickly blocked in the remaining portions of the mural. Ta-da! We finished it. <gasps> and also, I'm just kidding, and nobody gets $5,000. That sucks. We thought we were gonna win that money. Sorry, guys. Well, who won? We all are winners at the end of the day. Okay. <laughs> I think I'm done for the day. And with day one coming to an end, the artists attempted their last lines of the day. We're done for the night. We painted them white. Can I try one? Yeah. So we finished- Cut! Shut up! No! <laughs> Okay, we finished getting all this done. Never mind, I don't want to do this. <laughs> Let me do it. Do it together. Let Alrighty, we made everything white, and tomorrow we're going to come back oh. and we're going to do all the detailing. Woo! Not the smoothest closing to day one, but good job, guys. 
on to day two. Good morning, everybody. We're back for day two. Ben has just started detailing the roulette table, and then me and Ken's are gonna go around and start blocking in color, I guess, because, you know, we're not keeping it this way. David still has to finish Michelle's portrait, and then I'll start on Zach's. If you're wondering where he is, well, he's not here yet. He's a little late. He quit. In order to start painting the different parts of the mural, Mackenzie first had to mix some paint. Welcome to Mackenzie's paint mixing class. Today, we're gonna be learning how to mix these two colors. And since I wasn't around, it seemed like Jake and the other artists started to mess around and got distracted a bit more than usual. Ben! What? Arcane season two, first look. Let's watch. I'm painting something green. Stop eating your greens. Eat your spinach, everyone. Good for your muscles. Well, right now I'm the only one at this company that is doing their job. And after what seemed like an eternity, David finally showed up to paint. We've been painting here for an hour and David had finally decided to show up, so let's go get him. Oh, hey, welcome. Hey! Did you miss me? Show up on time or don't come at all. They missed me and they need me here. We do need him to paint portraits, but he is so over an hour late. late. I wasn't late. I said I was going to get here at 11, 11. The call time was 10. If this is my last craft shoot because I get fired, I'm so sorry. But even though they were messing around throughout the day, they continued to make great progress. Have all of the chest pieces blocked in. Ben is actually going in and working with the shadows for those now. We're making the chips three different colors. I'm currently blocking in with blue. Ken's is mixing the other paints. David's been working on Zach's portrait and it's looking pretty good, except I think the mouth is a little bit too pursed. No, I don't think it's too pursed. He's giving a little playful smirk. Zach does that. He does that with his face. He does that, that, but the mouth looks And the small. When Zach gets here and he says, what's wrong with my mouth? I'm gonna say, mm, roll the clip. Turns out, David did decide to fix the mouth and was able to finish both the portraits, while Mackenzie started to work on painting my dog. And Bine is literally dominating. I'm working on the roulette thing. Zach actually has no idea what we're painting. You literally just texting me, just make it look cool. Then, David and Ben started to guess how I'd react to their art. We'll go. I think it's gonna be more so like, oh, that's really cool. As the day went on, it seemed like tension was starting to build within the team. We're doing this as an Easter egg, but Jake messed up on the heart. That's not an Easter egg. This is mistake. wrong. Yeah, Jake keeps messing up everything, and I have to go around and fix all his mistakes. We're wasting time, but we're not gonna finish because Jake isn't good at his job. But regardless, the team was still moving at a great pace. Right now, I am trying to detail the poker chips, but those seem to be those tedious things on this wall. And uh, Ben still has a lot to detail, so he's about to be done with the roulette table. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be left by myself outlining everything. Like every mural. <laughs> I don't know how it gets to that point. Turns out, the artists were working at such a fast pace, Ben didn't even realize he made a mistake. They really wanted to finish before I got home. See this picture? See how it's red and, red and black? That's exactly yeah. what I'm doing right now. Move that. Uh, oh! Uh, you know what? Where's the red paint? This boy is just going to be a really big... That's what I would have done. Red piece. Yeah, yeah. Out of all the parts of the mural, the artist seemed to be struggling with the poker chips the most. You made the spacing wrong! Then add to it, I don't know. I'm adding highlights to this rook piece right now. Honestly, I'm so glad I'm working on chess pieces because I hate doing what Dave is doing. It's so bad. As time continued to run out for the artist, they ran into yet another problem while painting. There's a few cards left and nobody wants to do them, and I said I'm not doing them first. No, it's guys. Jake. Jake does that. I literally just said I'm not doing them first. Nose goes, Jake. No, that's not a thing. After painting all day, the artist began to mess around and it seemed like my videographer was instigating some potential arguments. Ben, rank them from best to worst. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the best. I'm also the second best. I'm also the third best. So I'm just a beast. A beast. Oh. Mackenzie, rate everyone artistically top to bottom. David being that makes no sense. Jake, how does that make you Jake, feel? That makes me feel so sad. Jake, will you rate everyone dumbest to smartest? Me? Smart. David is really dumb. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's true, he is really dumb, but somehow he got through college. I'm smart. It's called Teradactyl. P T E R A D A C T Y L. P T E O D A C T Y L. That's how you spell it. Teradactyl. Teradactyl. Put it down. <laughs> and even though Jake was calling David dumb, it seemed like Mackenzie was the true culprit in this scenario. Pterodactyl. <laughs> Wait, what? That's how Ken spelled pterodactyl. Ken was raised by cows. Pterodactyl. <laughs> <laughs> Bro. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> As day two came close to an end, there was only a few more things left for the artist to paint. Mainly working on the poker chips because those are a little bit tedious. And then we have some more cards to do. Lots of outlining to do. Lots of outlining to do. And then we'll be done. And now with everything blocked in, Ben started to finish the outlining. I just finished outlining everything, which means the whole mural is finally complete. And I have to say, this looks pretty cool. Or I think we have some finishing decorations to add to the poker room. But I think after that, this room's gonna look pretty sweet. Now that the mural was complete, all the artist needed to do was untape the walls and hang some LED lights. This is gonna look so cool. You guys ready for the last piece? Boom. To decorate this room, I think we're gonna do LED lights. Just probably like line up the TV, the flooring, ceiling. I think that should be good. Right now we are putting down the LED lights on the floor and it's looking pretty good. Just keep taping. With time running out before I arrive, the artist rushed to finish putting up the lights. We need to get the lights up stacked. I'm going, starting. guys. Oh, wait, I'm going guys. as fast as I can. Guys. Next thing we're going to do is oh, put them up on the ceiling. I'm just, mm. Hurry up. I'm plugging this Whoa, in. Whoa, what's going on? We got a little bit of time only. All right, we have Jake, 13 you minutes. Is Watch this. Is it working? No. I'm Everybody's doing so great, Ken. Do you need help? Yeah. Oh, maybe, maybe don't move the ladder while I'm on it. Ken, how about to make this go faster? I hold the ladder and I hold it up and I bring it with me and you can just go along. No. Finally, it was time for the big reveal. I'm a little nervous too, because I wasn't here for this, so I kind of just trusted them to do whatever. I hope it's good. They could have put up some weird There's stuff on the wall the for all I know. Before I was able to look at the wall, Jake seemed to have one last prank up his sleeve. Wait, hold on, give me a sec. Everyone's on the edge of their seats. I can't wait. Jake, he's almost done with his banana, hurry. <laughs> okay, Zach, are you ready to see this? I've been yeah. ready for 10 minutes. Three, two, one. And before I could get a good look at the art, something else Jake put on the TV caught my attention. In case you're wondering, Jake put up a super old music video I filmed. I'ma show you how to draw. Yeah, I'ma show you how to draw. Yeah, there's not much else to say. <laughs> After seeing the game room, I have to say, I'm so proud of my team. I honestly didn't think it would turn out this nice. Oh. You didn't have faith? <laughs> you didn't have faith in us? I was kind of scared because usually I'm with you guys in case anything goes wrong and I kind of just let you guys. Instead of you picking up the slack, Ben picked up the slack. And yeah. I led the entire team to victory. <laughs> Thank you guys. Yay! For this outro, I'll give you guys 10 seconds to say anything you want. Go watch Zach's music video eight, before he makes it seven, private! Yeah. 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 Subscribe and go follow them. We'll, we'll put your guys' ads up. Here. Whoa!